What's up guys, Cam Photo, and today I want to bring you a quick tutorial on the XC3 and how to set up the ISO dial and explaining how the ISO works. So, very quickly, when you first get your um, XC3 out of the box, the only way to change the ISO is through the Q menu. So you'd go in there and change it, not very good, so the way I like to do it is using the pressing in of the back dial. So the way to, to set it to that is you hold in that back dial. It'll pop up with all the different functions that you can use. You want to scroll down to page 3 where ISO is and select that. So now when you hold that down, it'll pop up with your ISOs. And you can choose which one you want. Okay, so now I want to explain the auto ISO a little bit. So when you choose one of your auto ISOs, this screen will come up asking you for your default sensitivity, max sensitivity, and min shutter speed. So how this works basically is your default sensitivity is going to be your low limit, your max sensitivity is going to be your high limit for your ISO. Um, and what the min shutter speed means is once the camera decides it needs to go below your min shutter speed for a proper exposure, that's when it will start raising the ISO, but it won't go above the maximum. So um, basically if in your dark conditions and you set your min shutter speed to 160th, it's pretty much going to stay at that. But if it gets brighter, your shutter speed will go up and your um, ISO will go back down. So yeah, hopefully that made some sense. Um, I don't know if it did, but uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.